there, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome, welcome, welcome back to another Saturday, which means it is time for another Nozwatch's Claymore. So, we're on the last episode. Oh boy, shit is going to either get really good, or it's going to get really fucked. So in the last couple episodes, it's kind of been on a, on a little bit of a downturn. It's a little bit of a downturn. So, thankfully, Priscilla's uh, new form, where it looks like she fucking went to DeviantArt and got an inflation fetish from the fucking Sonic fandom, that's not canon. That was made up for this fucking shit. But Claire's form, that is canon. And apparently, yeah, no, they fucked up the Rigaldo fight. Because she, that's what she's supposed to look like at the end of the Rigaldo fight. Way to go, anime! Ugh, why? But, whatever, let's see, let's, let's see how they finish off this ride. Let's see how badly they fuck it up, shall we? In three, two, one, and no! Yep, we get it. Last time on Dragon Ball Z, Claire unlocked the power of the Super Saiyan Blue. Can she defeat... Can she defeat Priscilla before Namek explodes? Find out next time on Dragon Ball Z. Alright. Just give me... Give me the good shit, though. Give me the good shit. Give me it. Oh, she's... Sayaku lost it! <laughs> Soul Jim turned to Griffin. Must be way back! I really did not need that blasting in my eardrums, thank you, anime. This is... yeah. This is- this is just- this- Oh god, that looks fucking awful. Holy fucking shit. Like, I hadn't internalized how bad. I hadn't internalized how fucking bad that form is. But. Like, you know, I think what it is, I think the proportions are fucked too. I think maybe if she had regular proportions, she'd look fine. But now it looks like a fucking. Now it was like a bad piece of fucking fan art where like the face is facing this way but the nose is facing this way and they just go it's my art style though you know like the like proportionally and like anatomically things don't make I wish I wish Sai was here she'd be able to be like oh no that's fucking garbage and be able to tell you why cuz she's the arty one but she's but she's in a different state until like October Oh. oh, like, like, oh, like, even in silhouette that looks bad. How did that get past any form of quality assurance? Holy, did they not have any? Like, you can see the difference, like, between Claire and... Oh, Jesus. Claire looks kind of like Nightmare in silhouette. She's just a little bit like a female Nightmare from Soul Calibur. Like, with wings. It's dumb. There's the pants shitting! And that is very much... That, and that is the least intimidating fucking voice to come out of that. Like, and it's like a fucking, like, giant monster Christ. Oh, good! Oh, good! At least blood is being drawn now.
Glad to see... Glad to see that we've just thrown out all characterization for Kurosu! 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 Great. It worked so well for the fucking Broly movies, I'm sure it'll work great here. Kakurai! Kakurai! It's also not all that great to look at, either. Wow. Wow. I could do that effect in, like, filming me moving a fucking image in Photoshop. Christ. This, this anime, like, it had... It had limitations before. It had limitations to the animation before, but this... This is something you'd expect out of a fucking, like, cartoon from the 60s. Where they would take a still image and then overlay, like, a shitty explosion filter in it. But because, it, because the fucking budgets back then were so fucking low. Jesus. Take some pride in your work. No, murder has to happen. Stop crying, you bitch. I want to get a good look at the awakened arm sheet, the, the awakened fake arm. Or, no, awakened fake arm, the awakened borrowed arm. Because, because it's, because it looks normal. That arm isn't awakened at all. Or at least I can't see it. I wish they wouldn't just keep... No, that's just a, that's just a normal fucking arm. What the fuck? That, that's just a normal arm. That's... That disappoints me. Was she that big before? Is it just me, or did Priscilla scale herself up? Like... Also, why is Claire's blood still red? She's awakened, right? It's supposed to be purple. This is a fucking mess. This is actually a fucking mess. That Christ, that act like I I'm i I'm sorry, I know I'm repeating myself, but that just looks awful. Wait, that it was that easy. It was that easy. Is that it? Oh, come on. Oh, come the fuck on. That, that's not it. There's no way that's it. Come on now. That's it. She's reverted back to human form. I have never been more disappointed in my life. I have never seen an anime drop the ball this fucking hard. Claire, it's me! Ghost Teresa! Except it's actually Racky! Don't kill this person you've spent your whole life trying to kill! Cease! 
The power of friendship shall revert this horrible transformation. Please kill him. Cut through him and kill her for fuck's sake. Yes, and then she turned around and killed everyone, Raki, you fucking idiot. She is a Yoma. Racky, you moron. Priscilla is a Yoma. Priscilla is a fucking Yoma. Jesus fucking Christ, Justin Trudeau, calm down. If we kill our enemies, then they win. Fuck off. Cut through him. If anything, him hugging you makes it easier to swing. The power of friendship! Kill him. Kill him. Kill them both. Kill them both. He's a disappointment. Kill him. Like, I don't care anymore. I don't care anymore. That fight was flaccid. This is stupid. The reasoning is so fucking faulty that it's... Oh, God. End me. Fucking end me, fam. Ugh. Oh. Cease this bullshit, my dude. Rocky, get out of my way. Kill him. Please. 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 Yes. 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 Yes! 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 Oh, Jean, come on. Fuck you, Jean. Fuck you, Jean. I almost got a little bit of fucking enjoyment out of that. Some fucking horse shit. This is fucking lame. This is. Fucking lame, my dude. Christ. Like... Like, this is actually lame. Like, I, I get it. Like, the, the, the manga wasn't done yet, and, the, and this anime's supposed to be like, Oh, go, go read the manga! But this doesn't want to make me read the manga. So what's me, what's this makes me want to do the opposite. Makes me want to, like, fucking sell the manga. I'm not reading this anymore. Into the fucking fire it goes. Oof. Hooray for friendship. This is dumb. This is dumb. Holy fu- How do you drop- How do you go from being one of the most entertaining anime I've seen in a long while to the dumbest? How do you drop the ball this hard? Ugh. <sighs> Kill Priscilla. Like, Priscilla is still right there. You, all you gotta do is drop your sword on her. Christ.
Like, this, this ends with... Oh, Christ. Like, I'm sorry, but this is... I, I... This is bad. Like, this isn't interesting. Like, her goal is taken away from her. Priscilla's gonna go on to do more fucking murders. If Raki's not gonna let him kill her. Isley's still gonna be around. Nothing was solved here. And they ain't gonna kill Isley in fucking eight minutes. And if they do, Christ, that'd be lame. Well, no more Giga Drill Breakers. No more of them. This has no emotional impact because it all feels like you're just fucking pulling the rug out. Like... And the bad guy's right there and she's still breathing! Hi, Griffith. So I guess your revenge your your revenge story continues, Claire. <sighs> so we don't even get to fight him. And then you can get or get in here. Oh no, he used instant transmission. Nothing was solved. Holy fucking shit. Well done, Racky. Well done. You made everything worse. But why, though? Nothing happened. Literally nothing happened. Like, oh god. Yeah, I feel like this finale is, is them going, hey, go read the manga. But this is so... This is so fucking... Like, it's such a bad taste in the mouth that I... That it, like, I'm not gonna- I wasn't gonna read the manga anyway, because I don't have time to read a manga. But... I guess there's such a bad taste in my mouth. Holy Christ. Oh boy, the Claymore Rebellion arc. I sure hope we get to see that. No, we don't. Why did she just become anime? Why did she just become anime with, with the generic anime pose? Like... Jesus Christ. The people who, were, who came up with this, with this ending for this anime because they couldn't, because they didn't want to follow the rest of the manga, I really hope they never made another anime. Holy fuck. Because they goofed this. Like, this has retroactively soured my taste of the series. Holy shit.
Stop dying, Claire! Stop it! We don't got enough claymores for you to awaken every five minutes. Fuck you, Racky. Actually, fuck you. Of course he does, he's only thinking with his dick. Is... is that his most said word? Claire! Like, is that his most said fucking line? It feels like it. Jesus Christ, Racky, fuck you. And fuck you, Griffith. Ugh. They, they, they could have sent this off with a good send-off. They could have done did that, but they didn't. Christ. I don't even know how I would do it. But... I wouldn't do it this way, I'll tell you that much. I'll have to have a think. Oh, boy. No, she'd say, why didn't you get your vengeance, you dink? You should have done a revenge. God damn it. Teresa just shows up like Obi-Wan. Claire, you must go to the Dagobah system to train under my old master, Yoda. It is there Yoda will teach you the ways of the Claymore. Claire, you've turned off your targeting computer. <laughs> oh, Christ. Is there even anything at the end of this? There is not. Good. Christ. All right, so... God, I'm still going to record Steins Gate today. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. All right, so... So, mm. <laughs> I've never actually had an, I've never actually seen an anime fucking trip over its own dick and eat so much shit at the last fucking hurdle. Holy crap. Like the last episode, not super great. It was passable. But this one, this episode. Oh my god, like, it's 110% like meant to be like, Hey, if you want to see the continued adventures of Racky and Claire, then you should pick up the manga available at your local fucking doujin shop. Fuck you. But this does the opposite to me. Like, if I, if I was not aware that this ending part was made entirely for the anime and has no bearing on the manga, I would go... Wow, at about this point in time, the manga writing starts to be shit. And I would not look into it any further. Like, the fact that I know that the manga breaks off from this way earlier, and is actually pretty decent as far as you guys have told me, makes me think, yeah, no, this, this anime, this ending, probably hurt sales of the manga more than it fucking helped. Holy fucking shit, like, oh, but, like, do I, like, I, I don't even know where to fucking start with this, holy fucking shit, like, Priscilla's design, shit, Priscilla's fight, shit, the animation of the fight, shit, like, it's literally just tweening JPEGs across a fucking screen, all it is, and then they add in the, that shit. The shit they do in Dragon Ball when they're cutting into a fucking fight to have a dialogue. Like, they do that in Dragon Ball so someone can have a dialogue. So they can have Goku, Goku front screen talking to, to his enemy, being like, Hey, you're pretty good. My name's Son Goku. Meanwhile, you've got his face, and then around you've got fists going... 
and then you cut to the opponent, and it's the same fucking thing, like, hey, Goku, I, my name is Bad Guy McBatterson. Philosophy. But here, no, that's just how they fucking fight. This is how they fucking fight. What the fuck? That's stupid. No, don't do that. Like, if you're gonna do that, have some fucking banter, or some fucking talk, or a fucking debate. Instead, we had the fucking Broly movie equivalent. We had- we had Broly versus Broly, it'd be like, fucking... Like, she's going like, kill, 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 and Priscilla's going like, You killed Mama, you killed Papa, you killed Mama, you killed Papa, like... No! <laughs> That's not how you do a fight! If you- if you're limited on your fucking fight animation and you're filling it with discussion, have an actual discussion fucking happen! Holy shit! Like, I don't know what they would've put in there because, fuck, I don't fucking know, but still, something! Either have a balls to the wall drag out fight between two fucking semi sapient monsters, or have them have a lively debate while they fucking throw punch lasers at each other. One of the two! Pick one! You can't do both! Like, shit! Oh my fucking god, like. It's the reason why people don't like the other Broly movies. Like, the ones where Broly was no longer, like, a fucking, like, a shy, uh, like, a, like a fucking shy, quiet person who fucking slowly lost his mind to be a monster, and instead they just made it so that he was the big fucking monster that didn't speak English from the start. Like, Jesus Christ, this was, bro this was Bio Broly. Like, this is the anime equivalent of Bio Broly. Fuck's sake. Holy shit balls. Oh, God. I don't even... I don't even fucking know how to start. Like, like honestly, the problems here start six episodes ago. So, just follow what I said to fix it, like, six episodes ago. Like, cr I'm not even saying four episodes ago. Feels like six. Oh, God. Like, I, I don't even, like... You yeah you'd have to you'd have to you'd have to go back, you'd have to go back and you'd have to just follow the manga, like because what I've been told of how the manga does it is is actually is something where I'm like you know what I'd watch that, but this no, why is Raki there? Why is Raki got arc nullification? I mean I know I know why it's because he's not there in the manga they just threw him in, like why do why do the other claymores act the well, that's not great. Why do the other Claymores act the way they do? Why... Why Why does Jean, Helen, and all that... Why, Like, why does the power scaling not work? Why can they stand against awakened Priscilla when Claire in her awakened form is shown to be way more powerful than them, but gets not swapped around like a housefly? Like, like these are all rhetorical questions, by the way. Just making sure. Like, because they they're questions from the last episode that you actually all answered, so thank you. But this was bad! Like, I, I, I'm sorry, like, I, there, there's no fixing this in this current state, like, and I hate saying that, because I like to think, I like to think that every single bad thing can be fixed. Like, I believe even Gate could have become a good anime in an alternate universe somewhere. But this episode specifically, like, the problems in this episode are deeply rooted, like, the second they went off the fucking manga rails. The only way to fix it would be to go back and just undo that fuck up, but... They're not gonna do that because this anime is like ten years old now. Like, oh boy, I just ugh, ugh. Like, I'm sorry. Like, if you like this anime adaptation, I'm sorry, but it's not good. This final episode just kind of taints the whole thing. Like, they have all this build up to Priscilla. Like, like they weren't going to continue this. They weren't going- it's clear that they're not going to continue this. So... So why did they not give it an actual ending and then at the end be like, See the rest of Claire and Rocky's adventures. Buy Claymore in your local doujin shop. And I know doujin is fan manga, I'm being an asshole. Um, you know, like... Eh, why? Like, Claire's entire... Claire's entire story arc is, I gotta, I gotta kill Priscilla. Raki's entire arc is, I gotta protect Claire. All the other Claymores is like, we gotta not die! So why not have Claire kill Priscilla? Why not wrap that arc up? Then why not have Raki come in and then do his power of friendship thing? Like, the fight 
the fight in this episode would still be horseshit. It would still be awful. But at least you'd have closure at the end. It's... It's just not good. I don't... I don't... I, I can't think of a way to fix this and make it, like, an actual serviceable episode. Like, all I can think of is how to give it closure, and it's just as simple as kill the fucking bad guy. Just... Anna, that's all I got. Like, I'm sorry. Like, I know, like, you probably by this point expect, like, a big breakdown, but, oh, God. Um, but anime as a whole, I, I want to say I like this show, because I do. Up until we got to Pieta, this was one of my favorite anime that I've done a react to. The fighting was great, the characterization was great, the world building was a little bit muddy, but it was like, muddy in the good way, in that, like, it left plenty of space for you to think, and be like, ooh, 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 but, <sighs> like, honestly, if I was to tell someone, like, to watch this anime, I would say, stop before, like, the second you hear the word Pieta, stop watching. Like, that would be, that would be what I would say, and that's not a good, that's, that's not a good thing to say. That's really not a good thing to say. Like, like you can't really just go to someone and say, "Hey, stop watching, stop watching." Fucking with well, like six, seven episodes left. Oh, oh boy. Like, I like I like Claire and Raki's relationship in the early parts. I like that we cut. Like, honestly, I honestly, if I would make say one thing about this entire series that like I I have a little bit of a issue with. I would say that probably you, we, I would want to make it so that the Teresa flashback happens first, and then have Raki and Claire. But that's just me. It just feels like the flow is kind of broken there, but that's, once again, that's entirely personal preference on that. Um, just... I, I just don't... I just don't know, dude. I just don't know. Like... It's a good show. Good show. But the last six episodes are fucking trash. Like, what the fuck? Like, like, how does that happen? Like, I'm thinking, like, just thinking back, like, about, like, all of the, like, good bits. Like, the bit with Ophelia. Like, like, every single problem I have, every single problem I have is, is in these last six episodes. Everything before this was basically perfect as far as an anime from ten years ago could be. This is from, like, 2008, right? I'm not getting this mixed up with something else. I'm not gonna look it up, but... Yeah! For an anime that's this old... Like, this is basically fucking perfect. I can't think of a single issue. And then they fuck it up with it, like... Like, I, I, like... Like, like... Other than the whole Teresa flashback, probably should've... Going for... Like, once again, that's... That, that, but that's subjective! That's subjective! The only... That's the only issue I have... Like, before this last six episodes, and that's a subjective issue! It's not even a real issue, it didn't actually d hurt the plot at all! Like, objectively, it's a good show, until you get to the end! I- 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 I've never seen this before! I've never actually seen an anime fuck- like, fuck it up this- fuck it up this way! Like, jeez, um... Like, it's a good show! It's a good show! And- that's all, that's really all I got. Thank you, Niskurdy, for recommending it. I wish you'd warned me that the last six episodes get retarded. <laughs> but, good show. Good show. I like it. It's good. Fucking thumbs up. Like, Racky's, Racky's alright. He becomes alright. Claire is fun in her own special way. Teresa's a good mentor figure. We get just enough of her. Priscilla is an interesting villain until she shows up. Like, and the Yoma, and the whole Yoma, Yoki, Claymore connection, it's, it's good. It's good, it's a really good world building. What we see of the human civilizations early on, it's decent as well. I wish we got a little bit more of that, but what we did get was really good. Fuck me. Oh, jeez. Anyway, let me know what you think down there in the comments, or what you think of, like, this whole, this whole Claymore thing, because it's good. I think it's good. I thought it was fun. What do you think of the ending? How would you fix the ending? You know what? Fuck it. Throw that at you. How would you fix the ending? Let me know down there in the comments. Anyway, buddy, as always, I am Nozick. Remember to like, comment, favorite, subscribe, all that good shit. And if you love my content and you want to be able to help guide my hips a bit, 
you can always support me on Patreon. That gets you access to the special patrons-only Discord channel on the open Discord server, where you can recommend things to be Let's Played, reacted to, live-streamed, whatever. And also you get access to the patrons-only movie night that is happening, I think, at the end of this week. Uh, actually, it's happening tomorrow by the time this goes up, I think. I think. But yeah, that's gonna be fun. We're gonna be watching some Aminés. Oh boy. Anyway, I'll see you in the next video. But most importantly of all, become a trash man all the day. And I'll see you a round up.